Jose Hernandez Rivera had an extraordinary military career. He fought with the U.S. Army's 65th Infantry Regiment, Boricaneers, hailing from Puerto Rico in the Korean War. He served 24 years in the U.S. Navy, 16 of those serving abroad five different warships, and the rest stationed in the, Car the Caribbean, the Mediterranean, and the United States. He assisted with the training and preparation of sailors for the Bay of Pig Invasion. He was one of the first master at arms when this position was reestablished by the U.S. Navy in 1973. And in between all of that, he became proficient in karate, which he still teaches to this day and holds a fifth degree black belt ranking. Mr. Hernandez Rivera started his military service on January 21st, 1952. After basic training, he was shipped out to Korea as a fighting member of Company F, 2nd Battalion, 65th Infantry. He was cast onto the front lines of the Korean War. In his interview, he stated, I don't like to talk about it. It's not easy to see one of your buddies blown up. Of his Korean War experiences, he stated, I survived the cold weather and I survived the shelling. He received an honorable discharge from the U.S. Army. However, Mr. Hernandez Rivera found that he actually missed the military and subsequently joined the U.S. Navy. He went on to a brilliant 24-year career in the Navy, becoming one of its first master at arms. He was selected as only one of 40 out of 10,000 applicants. One of the reasons for his selection was his proficiency in karate. Mr. Hernandez Rivera's superior skill in karate was very valuable in training master at arms personnel in self-defense, crowd control, and other police duties. In my interview with Mr. Hernandez Rivera, he mentioned some ethnic prejudice he has encountered, especially while in Texas. In Galveston, Texas, he was once called a wetback, a term he didn't even understand at the time, having been raised in the Caribbean. These types of remarks were no deterrent to Mr. Hernandez's outstanding contributions to his country. Today, it is recognized that 66,000 soldiers of the 65th Infantry Boricaneers, the all Puerto Rican regiments, have distinguished themselves as true American war heroes. Ms. Hernando Rivera stands as part of this exceptional group. Please stand and give a rousing ovation for Jose Hernandez Rivera, who is the embodiment of honor and fidelity to the country. 